redefining the Dark Ages. This beautiful treasure has got archaeologists so excited, they're saying it could change the way we look at Anglo-Saxon history forever. And these sword fittings are just the start of a hoard of around one and a half thousand different pieces. It was all found in a Staffordshire field by one man with a metal detector. These are just some of the items that turned up when Terry Herbert was doing a spot of metal detectoring on some private land. It's now being said that this find is of real importance to the nation and it's been declared as treasure, meaning it belongs to the Queen. But as for how much it's worth, well, it could take up to a year for it all to be valued. All in all, this lot contains about five kilograms of gold and two and a half kilograms of silver. Experts think it's from the late 7th and early 8th century and must have belonged to a king because there's so much of it and it's all so valuable. At the moment, the treasure is in secure storage at Birmingham Museum, but it'll be available to see on display from tomorrow. The quality and quantity of this unique treasure are remarkable. But as it's pieced together, the story of how it came to be left in the Staffordshire soil is likely to be more remarkable still. Here we are today at uh, Thomas Heritage Festival weekend and uh, we're lucky enough to find amongst our Saxon festival, Terry Herbert, the man who actually found the Staffordshire Hoard back in 2009. Terry, how did you know about our event today? What brought you to Tom? Well, I saw it on the, on the internet, like, because uh, some leaflets would have been going around, like, so I thought this time I'm going to come. I didn't come last year, but I virtually kept it in the background, because like, I thought this year I'm coming. We're really, really glad to have you in town to the castle and have a look at our uh, Saxon display and some of the items which yeah. you found. Just a very small sample of the three and a half, four thousand that you yeah. found in the field. Um, are you still metal detecting? Yeah, I'm still going out there metal detecting, yeah. And still finding some great pieces? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a stupid question. Has it changed your life? Yeah, in one way, I suppose, yes. But uh, I get the feedback of other people trying to change it for me, like, you know. <laughs> I ought to be doing this, I ought to be doing that, like, you know. But I'm still the same person, right? But we, you recognise all that. And also, you have your own catchphrase now, don't you? Uh, boy, me. <laughs> yeah, boy, me. Well, we're certainly glad you found it because it certainly made um, a huge impact on our history and heritage as the ancient capital of Mercia. Um, and any time we have any Saxon events, we'd love you to come along and, uh, and just say, be a part of what yeah. we're doing here. Thanks very much.